have a, uh, a Locksaw businessman and a fisherman, uh, Lynn Richardson. Sorry guys, I have a little written response. If this was a safety speech, I'd be a little more comfortable doing this. But this is my first time here. So I'm um, here to show my support to Idaho Rivers United and, and uh, show my support for Locksaw River Drainage here. So um, I live here in Boise for the, uh, the past 15 years. I have worked as a raft and fishing guide on Locksaw and Clearwater Rivers. For the past five years, my wife and I have managed a small whitewater photography business taking pictures of boaters on the locks off. We plan to head back to the locks to the Highway 12 corridor this next spring. As a river guide and recreational whitewater boater, I have traveled in the world in search of whitewater adventures. I run rivers in both North and South America, but we return religiously every year to the locks off. Its rapids are world class, and some even say that it offers one of the best whitewater one day trips in North America. It's home to incredible wildlife. We frequently see elk, deer, otters, bears, and harlequin ducks along the way. Locksaw is beautiful. What we really like most about the Locksaw is the fishing. I'm not working on the river, I'm frequently fishing alongside its shores. I fish for salmon in the spring, steelhead and trout in the summer and fall. I can find easy access due to the turnouts along the river. It's a blue ribbon trout stream. And at low water, the dry fly fishing for native cutthroats is some of the best I've ever experienced in Idaho. I'm here today because I'm worried about the Highway 12 mega loads will block access to the river. And I'm especially worried about the hundreds of Exxon Mobil loads that will travel the highway year round. I'm also worried about authorizing closure of the pullouts. This sort of interruption to commerce and recreation is unacceptable. Closing of the turnouts will deny public access to both the river and the surrounding forest. Please, ITD, please don't take this away from us. And please don't let the oil companies diminish the experience of our visitors who come to Highway 12 and the locks on Clearwater Rivers. Thank you very much.